That was a tough couple of hours' work there, wasn't it? I hope he appreciates this. Do you know, I think we've gone to a lot of trouble and it shows how much we care. <laughs> Firstly, in the welcoming him yes. back into the house after a holiday away. It's always nice to be back home. Should we, um, should we walk through it as if he would? So he's yeah. just opened the door, he's got his cases, you know what it's like, it's a bit of a struggle. And he can't open the door properly. There might be the odd bang as well. This is thanks to Julia Jones from Droitwich. She said, fill the house with balloons. So that is his little greeting it's right there. Welcome. It's but properly <laughs> welcoming. Don't you love it? I think that should be a trend. You should start doing that everywhere. But Amanda Ramford then suggested hiding the remote because he loves his TV. Well, Amanda, if you spot up there on top of the blind, your wish is our command. There's his TV remote. I wonder how long it would take before he realises that. Yeah, exactly where it is. I wouldn't think to look there. I really wouldn't. However, there was a bit of gaffer tape left over, so obviously we've taped the sofa a little bit. Well, we also found his broadband router and his iPad. So, so up on, the on the ceiling was the obvious place to yes. stick those. So he'll be looking for those for ages. And I when reckon. he wants to sit down on the sofa, of course, you'll have to remove all the welcoming balloons and gaffer tape from there. <sighs> now, right. another suggestion was uh, if we come through, through the hallway to Hursty's bedroom slash boudoir. This was Felipe's suggestion, rearrange yeah. the furniture. So we've kind of given him a holiday feel in the bedroom with deck chairs. That's nice, it's like the holiday continues when you get home, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, and, uh, and obviously moved all the chairs in here. And I, I, I'm going to actually say, because I was going to hoover, but then I ran out of time. But yeah. left them in here because we had to rush. Oh, yeah, because you have to yeah. move all the stuff yeah. to Hoover, yeah. So the thought was there. The thought, That's nice. just the action didn't happen. Yeah, so that would be good. I mean, yeah, it won't matter that he's tired. He could always have a lie down on the floor, <laughs> couldn't he? I mean, who needs a bed? That is very true. And then we come through to the kitchen. Um, another wonderful idea. Yeah, well, Christine Graham said you could wrap everything in Christmas paper, but Hursty loves Christmas. So we went with Ollie's suggestion of just tinfoiling everything. And just admire the hand you... I mean... If he wants a cup of tea, I think it's still obvious where the kettle is, but then he might need to wash up a few mugs um, from the mug tree, and then if he wants to make his lunch, just to unwrap a plate first. But it is like Christmas, it's a whole experience. And of course, we fed the cake. Oh yes. And then I wrapped it doubly sure to make sure that it's still gonna be moist. That's a very good idea. Oh yes, and the fridge. Well, this the was fridge. a bit of a health hazard actually, wasn't it? So we've helped him out. Yeah. yeah. We've just decided he shouldn't open it, so we've gaffer taped that. And mm. the cupboards as well. Um, treat himself to a takeaway, you see, that's what we're encouraging. Yeah, exactly. Um, I quite like these touches here. The uh, hoover and the broom have been foiled as well. Do you know, I think it'll be about a week before he notices that these are out of Could be longer. Could be longer. By the look of the house. <laughs> and then uh, we move into the bathroom. Oh, yeah, the bathroom. And it was actually Rosie Hawkins, thanks Rosie, who said cling film the toilet. Thought that was slightly mean, so instead we've just sellotaped the lid down. So he's still got a bit of hard work to do. So considerate, though. I Should he want to sink into um, a nice bath or have a shower, perhaps, then uh, he's got to remove gaffer tape first and, of course, the taps. We had a bit of foil left, didn't we? So. Well, I mean, you can't waste it, can you? Yeah. It's pound shop's finest. So, yeah. yeah. So there we go. I mean, that's pretty much it. Oh, that, do you know what? There was another good suggestion, wasn't there? Light bulbs. There was a very good suggestion. Andrew Wilson actually yeah. said, not only remove light bulbs, but any sort of fuses. We, we, we think the light bulbs is possibly yeah. the next touch, because it's taken a while to do this, to be honest, and we've it? got homes to go to. Well, let's unscrew some light bulbs. Okay. Yeah, let's do that, and then we'll go. We'll call yeah. it a day.